Friday, March 26, 2010. Um, good week. Ended up getting... Oh, and I failed completely on the uh, not weighing myself every day front. I actually think this past week I weighed myself more often than usual. Um, but um, I did end up getting down to... 342.5 pounds yesterday, but then today I'm up a pound, so, you know, for, again, no reason, no reason whatsoever, nothing changed, so, a pound is a pound, maybe I need to go take a shit, who knows, um, but today, uh, 343.5, which is a weight loss of 6 pounds since last Friday, um, this is the first week where um, the restrictions went into effect, so basically I've reduced my intake by about a third, um, and obviously it worked pretty well. Um, when I, I actually got down to 343 on maybe even Tuesday, so I wrote on my little... Uh, Diary, which that's what they call it on Fit Day, which is a software program that I use to uh, keep track of my weight and the goal and whatnot. I wrote, "Wow, I might even, I might even drop below 340 this week by Friday." But um, it, it's strange, you know, for no reason. I dropped like two, three pounds in one day, and then that's pretty much where I stuck. So, um, 343 and a half today. That is a um, Total weight loss so far, 44 pounds. Um, total inches lost, I didn't bother to uh, add up. Um, I went up a quarter of an inch in a couple of places, uh, but again, I, like in the, uh, the video I made uh, about a month ago, um, that could just be human error. Um, so I'm actually down maybe an inch, an inch and a half total this week. But, um, and that should take me to over 20 inches total uh, since December 31st, 2009. So not bad for less than three months. Less than three months, I'm um, 44 pounds and over 20 inches. And I feel good. I feel a lot better. Um, even simple things like getting up off my couch or um, bending over and putting my shoes on or, um, you know, breathing a bit better and just, you know, a sense of well-being and optimism and, you know, just knowing that I'm on the right track. So, um, as of now, I'm actually on pace to drop below 300 pounds about two weeks ahead of schedule. Um, I like having that buffer, though. But um, my, my goal date is still July 1st. I've actually, I spoke with my roommate and He's cool if I make it July 2nd, because July 2nd actually falls on a Friday, so that would be perfect, since I always weigh myself on Fridays. Um, not much else has happened. In fact, I actually I took the week off from the gym entirely. I didn't even lift weights. I went and uh, bench-pressed on Monday. Had a real shitty day. Um, I'm really struggling with my bench-press. I, I don't know why. I would think that my other larger, more compound movements would have been... Uh, more negatively affected by this weight loss, but the stupid fucking bench press has been what's most affected. Um, and, you know, I just have aches and pains. My I fucked my wrist up last Thursday um, doing shoulders, and I kind of fucked up my left elbow doing bench the previous week, and my foot is still not fully recovered, and um, I was feeling a little bit beat up from the gym, so... After Monday, I decided to take the rest of the week off from the gym. So, you know, six pounds lost, uh, zero activity, you know, other than walking to the store and whatnot. Not, not walking to the store. Driving to the store and then walking around the store. Um, walking to the store, that's just hilarious. Um, especially, yeah, in Las Vegas. I guess I can get away with that now that it's pre-springtime, but not when the summer hits. I actually, I just spent $150 getting my shitty car all prepped as best as, as possible for the Las Vegas summer. I got the windows tinted, and which sounds ghetto to me, but 
apparently here in Las Vegas you have to have your windows tinted or your car is just an oven when you get in and I got my air conditioning fixed so um, as long as my transmission doesn't go between uh, now and then my car should be uh, good to go I don't think I have anything else to say let me uh, pause for an awkward moment of silence No, no. So, uh, plan for this upcoming week, um, roughly the same amount of calories. I've been eating two meals per day, two substantial meals per day. I'm still over 3,000 calories per day that I'm consuming. Um, those, those meals are within a, a nine or a ten hour window, so essentially I'm going through a 15 hour fast every day. Um, I, I usually eat around noon and then again at nine. So from 9.30 until noon the next day, I'm not eating. Um, and again, I always have to offer this disclaimer because conventional wisdom is wrong as usual. Um, this is not anorexia. This is not me restricting myself to some extremely unusual eating practices. Um, a planned, or it should be called intermittent sporadic fasting, um, is healthy. I'm eating plenty, I'm eating over 3,000 calories a day. I'm still, you know, busting ass in the gym as best I can. This is not some, um, some strange, dangerous thing that I'm doing. So, um, well, it's only less than seven minutes into the video and that's all I, that's all I got. So, yeah, um, I'm going to stop, I'm going to stop there. So. Next Friday, as usual, uh, pictures to follow, and um, oh, and in this photo set, I think I've finally noticed a difference in the back picture. In the back picture is always my least favorite picture. So finally, 44 pounds, and I can notice some difference in, from the rear perspective. Um, so thanks for watching, thanks for subbing, and uh, I hope everything's going well. And until next time.